Welcome to Poultry Farm Guide. Today, I bring to you yet another powerful and potent herbs in the poultry world, which is aloe vera. On today's video, I will share with you the benefits of using aloe vera for your chicken, how to prepare or use aloe vera for your chicken, is aloe vera poisonous or toxic to your chicken, what are the dosage or dosage volume or inclusion rate of aloe vera in water and feed of your chicken. So stay tuned, I will be right back. My name is Ezra Uncle Summer from PoultryFarmGuide.com. On this channel, I share helpful tips and guides to enable you to set up your poultry farming business and scale it up. Welcome back. As I said earlier, I'm going to share with you how to use aloe vera for chicken. We all know that aloe vera is one of the most useful or medicinal herbs used for its therapeutic or commercial purposes. I've seen aloe vera being used in cosmetic products and products. I personally used aloe vera to remove some spots, especially from my face. Then I know aloe vera is a potent herb and I'm considering adding it in our garden as well soon. So now I did research on aloe vera, how to use aloe vera for chicken. As well, can you use aloe vera for chicken? However, aloe vera is meant to be used externally only. But with some researches have proven that aloe vera can also be used externally for animals. So there's no farms in using aloe vera for your chickens. Now, what are the effects of aloe vera in chicken or the benefits of aloe vera chicken? Now, we all know that in broiler farming, the major reason for broiler farming is to attain weight at a very short time, broiler weight gain, and to improve feed conversion ratio. Now, in broiler, when you come to broiler farming, you talk about the number of feed to give to a bed to attain a certain weight. And through research, uh, aloe vera have been proven to improve as an additive to improve broiler growth, and it can also be used as a substitute of synthetic root promoters. The parts used in aloe vera is the leaf fat, which is made up of a 90, which is made up of 99%, 99.5% of water. The dry mass, the other dry matter or dry mass contain active ingredients. And these ingredients have been proven to possess antimicrobial properties, antiviral, antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, and so on. Other benefit of aloe vera for chicken is that it keeps chicken away from procidiosis or it protects chicken against procidiosis, the disease that causes bloody pool in your chicken. It protects or improves the immune system of the chicken against major diseases like infectious bursal disease, gumburu. It also improves the intestinal health of the chicken against common diseases like foul cholera and foul typhoid. You can also use aloe vera as a potent healer to heal wound like foul pus. You can use aloe vera to treat the black spot in the in the foul pots, you scrape it and squeeze the gel on the spots after scraping the, the wound. Or you can also use it to treat the inflammation in chicken eyes. When chicken has some inflammation due to some diseases or some environmental stress, you can use it to squeeze, you can squeeze some of the gel in the chicken eyes and the swollenness of the eyes will stop. Now, how can you use chicken aloe vera for? Your chicken, the inclusion rate or the dosage volume. For research, putting one percent of an uh, aloe vera in water have been proven to improve roller weight gain. Other form of using aloe vera is the powder form, but this powder form is quite difficult to prepare. But the research has been proven that the powder form of aloe vera, two percent of aloe vera powder, have improved in general chicken performances. So in using two percent of aloe vera powder. You can put it in the chicken food if you intend to use aloe vera powder. So the most common way to use aloe vera is using the aloe vera gel. So adding 1% of aloe vera gel to chicken water have proven as a substitute for synthetic growth promoter. So that is how you can use aloe vera for your chicken. If you want to learn how to use garlic and then ginger for your chicken, you can share the link below or you can wait at the end of the video. I will leave the video at the end of this video. If this is your first time of visiting my channel, please consider to subscribe, like the video, click the notification bell so to, to be notified whenever I release my next video. Always make your beds happy because a happy bed make a happy farmer. See you on my next video. Sam is out. Bye bye.